Now we're ready for the pink test for lesson 21, the garden. I will read the question and then I will read your choices. Fill in only one choice. If you fill in two, you will get it wrong. So fill in only one choice. Number one. Who are the main characters in this story? Just Frog, Toad and the Seeds, Frog and Toad. Who are the main characters in this story? Just Frog, Toad and the Seeds, Frog and Toad. Mark your answer. Number two. What does Toad wish for at the beginning of the story? A new friend, a garden, someone to play with. What does Toad wish for at the beginning of the story? A new friend, a garden, someone to play with. Mark your choice in the circle. Number three. Is Frog a good friend to Toad? Yes, he plays with him. No, he tells Toad to go home. Yes, he gives Toad some seeds to plant. Is Frog a good friend to Toad? Yes, he plays with him. No, he tells Toad to go home. Yes, he gives Toad some seeds to plant. Mark one of the choices. If you need to go back and hear it again, just rewind it just a little bit, like go back a little bit. Okay, number four. What problem does Toad have? His seeds will not grow. It never rains on his seeds. He does not know how to read to his seeds. What problem does Toad have? His seeds will not grow. It never rains on his seeds. He does not know how to read to his seeds. Mark the correct answer that you think it is. Number five, are Toad's seeds really afraid to grow? Yes, Toad shouts too much. No, they like the dark. No, it takes time for them to grow. Are Toad's seeds really afraid to grow? Yes, Toad shouts too much. No, they like the dark. No, it takes time for them to grow. Mark your choice. And just one. Number six. At the end, how does Toad feel about growing seeds? It is a lot of fun. It is hard work. He should never grow seeds again. At the end, how does Toad feel about growing seeds? It is a lot of fun. It is hard work. He should never grow seeds again. 
mark your answer. Now we're going to turn the paper over to number seven. Now on this side we mark the best word that completes the sentence. Again, I will read it twice. Read the sentence twice and the choices twice. You mark only one choice. Number seven. Let's read a blank about stars. Loudly. Story. World. Let's read a blank about stars. Loudly. Story. World. Which word fits in here the best? Mark that choice. If you need to pause it, go ahead and pause and then start it again for this one. Number eight. My dad stays up late every blank. Noise. Night. Shall. My dad stays up late every blank. Noise, night, shall. Mark the correct answer that you think it is. Number nine. Move the paper. We shall get a blank things at the store. Window. You loudly. We shall get a blank things at the store. Window. Few. Loudly. Mark which one you think fits in this blank the best. Number 10. Did you know the blank has more water than land? World, night, window. Did you know the blank has more water than land? World, night, window. Mark your answer. Number 11. The birds are singing blank outside my window. Few. Loudly. Story. The birds are singing blank outside my window. Few. Loudly. And story. Mark the answer you think is correct. Number 12. Frogs make a lot of blank at night. Shall. Noise. World. Frogs make a lot of blank at night. Shall. Noise. World. Mark the answer that you think is correct that fits in this sentence. When you are done with this, turn both papers in to Mrs. Burke. Make sure your name is on both of them. Thank you.